Hello there, everybody. It's me, YouTube Dark Side, and welcome back to another video. Today, we're back shiny hunting in Pokemon Ultra Moon, where we are going to be talking to Miss Wick and getting ourselves a Type Null. Uh, the reason why Miss Wick is actually in the Aether Foundation, not in front of uh, How, where there's like a cutscene, is uh, that cutscene can be uh, bypassed. Basically, the cutscene is like around one to two minutes long. It's like a very long cutscene, and so to bypass it. Just fill your entire PC with Pokemon and your entire party with Pokemon and then Miss Quick will say that oh you don't have any space in your boxes or in your party to actually hold Type Null so I'll give it to you later. Uh, so that's how you can bypass that cutscene and so then you can get Shiny Type Null way faster instead of the like the one to two minutes. Uh, you just get Type Null and reset immediately over it around um, like like 30 seconds at max it's it's insane how quickly it's like it's good and so yeah i, d I did that i filled my entire pc filled my entire party talked to miss wick she was like come back later and then here's the thing if you start the team rainbow rocket uh takeover uh then you cannot talk to miss wick you need to finish the team rainbow rocket takeover so instead when you go to Miss Wick and you talk to her and she tells you to come back later, immediately go to the Aether Foundation so you can immediately get Type Null and so you don't have to do the Dream Team Rainbow Rocket takeover because that thing can take a while. So, yeah, this came after, hold on, let me check again, 3,804, which is just a little more than Poipol, so still under odds. Hopefully the next one doesn't go way too over odds, so we'll see what happens when that happens, I guess. Anyway, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe, and let's get right to it. Yo! Shiny type null! Yo! Oh, that, that is so good looking. Oh my god. Oh, look at that golden boy. <clears throat> oh, man. Man, that surprised me. I did not expect that. Alright, hold on. Let me, let me switch the screens and I'll be right back. Just one second. Alright, and we are back with... Pokemon Ultra Moon, oh my god, Shiny Type Null. This came after 3,804 soft resets. Still a little under odds. Uh, just a little bit over uh, Poipol. Poipol is 3586, this is 3804. Pretty cool, oh look at that thing. Shiny Dex. Oh, that looks so good. This is like my fourth Type Null, but I, these guys just look amazing. It's just a hunch, but I feel like this Pokemon is super rare. Oh, look at that. There is danger of its ongoing... There is danger of its going on a rampage. So its true power is sealed away beneath its control mask. And then when uh, when you level up its friendship to the max, it, it breaks its mask. Which is so cool. Synthetic Pokemon. Normal type. Tiny type? No. Alright. Give it a nickname? Nah, thanks. Add it to my party. Oh, man. I'll entrust you with all of the memory drives needed to change the type of type Null's evolution, the Pokemon Sylvalli. You received a whole stack of memory drives. Heck yeah. Type Null. It was being researched as a possible weapon to be used to fight the Ultra Beasts. But I think a trainer like you... Master Gladion thinks we'll be able to show Type Null that there is much more to this wide world than that. Master Gladion left to travel Kanto and Johto, so far away from here. Uh, for training? Yeah, that's right. He went to defeat trainers like you, Young Chiro, and Master Howe. 
He chose to go on a journey to train himself rather than take part in Alola's Island Challenge. If you do the same thing as everyone else, it is unlikely you'll surprise that you will surprise them. I think Master Gladion must remember the tales I have told him of catching Pokemon in regions like Kanto and have been inspired to action. I'm sorry, you probably aren't interested in hearing about that sort of thing, are you? Please accept this. Big Malasada. That's pretty cool. Take another one too. So th this is this is just pretty much the exact same chat you get uh, when you first meet uh, Miss Wick and she tries to give you the type null for the first time. It's legit the exact same chat. Odd. Even the the Malasadas, she gives them to you now instead of there, which is weird. I'll be returning to the converse, uh, conservation area to look after the Pokemon. Oh, that's sad. I'm not going to be able to see her anymore. She's like one of my favorites. Shiny type null. Heck yeah. Uh, what are you? There it is. Level 60. Ooh, that noise. That sounds so good. Less, uh, less special defense, more speed. Naive, I guess hasty. Battle armor, pretty good stats, not too shabby. Oh, look at it. Uh, can I, uh, switch? It's this, there we go. Oh, look at it. Dude, I, I love this thing so much. Uh, if you don't know, Type Null is basically supposed to be uh, a um, a fake Arceus. Uh, or at least Silvali becomes a fake Arceus. But she said that type, the memory drives are for Type Null's evolution. So, so yeah, this is, technically speaking, a fake Arceus. So, hey, that's... Uh, that's pretty cool. I love the story behind it. I don't know if I'm going to be evolving it. Because, you know, friendship takes a while to level up. But we'll see. This is my Shani Lin only save file. So, um, if you haven't watched that video, then go ahead and watch it, I guess. Alright, let's get going. Uh, did we already... Yeah, we already defeated that trainer. Because I've tried to level up uh, Lin as much as I can. Uh, before we actually do that, I do want to give it some pets. Uh, not you, Zygarde. Go away. This isn't this isn't your time. Go away. Where is there we go, type null. Are these all empty? Yeah, I guess they are. But I don't know why you're full. An executor isn't full. That is just odd. Whatever. Type null. Hello. How are you gonna eat though? I still have no Poke Beans. How are you gonna eat? You, you just eat. Cool. Let's give you some more. Man, the gold looks so good on it. I love this thing so much. And it's full, pretty much. I'm pretty sure its main is its favorite, right? No. Oh, over here. It's neck. It's like a cat. Come on, come on, raise your head. Raise your head, thank you. There we go. Do you... No, you like here. Oh, do you not like here? Yeah, you don't like it there. Cool. I guess it makes sense he doesn't want us touching his mask. Makes sense. I'm pretty sure Shiny Silvala is just, uh, is just a bit yellow. Tail? Well, we can pet your tail just fine. Alright, that's gonna be the last pet. I think instead of showing you the evolution, I might just uh, get my other Silvali here and show them to you. Just because Silvali looks pretty good. And I realize right now I did not save. <laughs> so I'm, I'm a save. Alright, let's go. We have ourselves regular Grand Bowl and shiny. Zygarde. Welp, I'm stupid. Alright, let's try this again. We have ourselves a regular Wingle and shiny type Null. Ooh, that thing looks so good. The sparkle, the yellow sparkles look so good with just his, his yellow appearance. That is such a good shiny, man. I love this thing so much. Alright, we'll sound him up one more time, then I'll show y'all uh, Silvalli. We have ourselves a regular Wingle, or Pelper, not Wingle. And type null. 
Whew. That is amazing. Alright, I'll, uh, I guess I'll end the video here. I'll just send out Zilvali to one battle. And, uh, yeah, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe. Good luck on our hunts, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Next time, take care. Goodbye, everyone. Alright, I know that I did an outro already, uh, but, uh, I do want to give Sylvali some pets, because Sylvali is cool. Uh, I think it's gonna be the normal type Sylvali, because I removed everything from him. There it is. Look at him. Little golden boy. Alright, come on. Eat some food. I I'm actually pretty sure he has some friendship levels with me. I don't know how. I think it's just because I used BK Hex to, tr to move it from there to here. And it keeps its affection level. It's either that or it's just... Uh, it stays from trainer to trainer. The affection level. The hearts. Yeah, it's just the same spot. Do you, do you have a, a thing like that? Like, you know, the, like, Poipole or Litten or anything cool. Nah, I just realized this was on the small screen. Well, whatever, it's fine. I want to check if Type Null has the same thing. Let's see. Do you? I don't think they do have a reaction. Poipole has a reaction, though. I'm pretty sure. Let me check. Am I right? Oh, wakey wakey. Hello. Poipole? Hello? Oh yeah, Poipole has fainted. Uh, I completely forgot about that. Uh, hold on, let me check out Sylvali right here. It's like that to make it bigger. As you can see, he is a, a normal type. I can change his typing, and I will right away, so... Look at, look at its, uh, like... Up there, it's... I don't know what it's called, the thing on its head and its tail. They're right now white, and that's because uh, it needs a held item. And there we go. So Vala is now holding the dragon memory, and as you can see, it's, it's blue, and it's dragon type now. I guess that's kind of cool. Dragon memory. A memory disk that contains dragon type data. It changes the type of the holder if held by, by a certain po a species of Pokemon. And he needs to have the RKS system. Changes the Pokemon's type to match the memory disc it holds. There's Type Null. It has actual battle armor, which protects it from critical hits, which I guess that's cool. Uh, and yeah, that's pretty much it. Let's change the screens back and let's send this out into one more battle. So, yeah, <laughs> goodbye everyone, I guess.